Okay, so that's our 4x6 marquee. We've got lights on there. We've just turned them off, but they do work. We've got some heaters in each corner, and obviously our chairs. So it's quite a good... And we've got a little opening here, which the customer requested. So they can have a little extension for the adults. There's going to be a little gaming room for the children in there, at that end. Um, so they can play their PlayStations. There's going to be a big screen up on the end of the tent there. Um, and then the adults can sit here and keep an eye on them, which all sounds very, very good. Hello again. Welcome to another video from Castle Kingdom. And this one, we're not doing a bouncy castle. We are doing a marquee, which we've got in the back here. We've got a four by six marquee where we're going to be bringing in. Some tables and chairs, which have fallen over as I've gone around the corner. But uh, yeah, so we've got to get all this stuff into this property here. So we've got to walk it right the way down this edge here, but it's nice and wide. Uh, and then we're going to set it up side on the back of the garden. Right, let's get to it. Right, now first thing we're going to do is I'm going to measure up garden now I did measure this before we came along uh, it should fit six meters length uh, I'm just gonna double check it while it's been cleared out of the way and make sure we can fit it all in Come out this line here. Yeah. That work, yeah. Six minutes there, so we've got about 200ml. Play with. Cool. All good. Put everything under the, um, the gazebo there. Right, we've laid it out dry as you can see. <clears throat> Each one of these bays is two meters, two, four, six. What was the concern is it was gonna come too close up against this. But it looks like we're gonna get it in all right. So that's a good thing. Uh, so yeah, now we're gonna start building the, the roof canopy section.
Okay, so that's our 4x6 marquee. Quite a good size. On this one, we haven't got any carpet, just some chairs. We've got lights on there. We've just turned them off, but they do work. We've got some heaters in each corner, and obviously our chairs. So it's quite a good size. And we've got a little opening here, which the customer requested. So they can have a little extension for the adults. There's going to be a little gaming room for the children in there, at that end. Um, so they can play their PlayStation. There's going to be a big screen up on the end of the tent there. Um, and then the adults can sit here and keep an eye on them, which all sounds very, very good. Okay, that's it. Hope you enjoyed the video and learned something from it. How to set up a 4x6 on your own or with uh, one helper. And yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.